Xenacanthus is a genus of extinct shark with more than 20 species described that uh, originate in the late Devonian period and uh, last appear in the end Triassic. And so therefore, during this time range, uh, this group of sharks survived the mass extinctions at the end of the Devonian, survived the even worse extinctions at the end of the Permian period, but perhaps uh, were done in by the mass extinctions at the end of the Triassic. Uh, that being said, they were quite a long-lived group of fossil sharks. Uh, most of them were about a meter in length, although some could be two meters uh, or uh, more, and they are freshwater sharks. That's unusual today because there are so many bony fish uh, which have diversified and have um, dominated uh, freshwater environments. Um, but in the Paleozoic and early Mesozoic, uh, the teleos either had not yet evolved or in the uh, Triassic period, they had just evolved. So they had not yet occupied the ecological niches of today. And so apparently Xenacanthus uh, was able uh, then to establish itself uh, in freshwater uh, in niches uh, where predominantly uh, uh, the bony fish uh, live uh, today. Uh, they would have been uh, predators, probably uh, feeding on uh, crustaceans and uh, bony fish, and perhaps had their own predators as well, as indicated by the large prominent uh, spine uh, which grew out of the back of uh, the skull. This was movable, and it seems to have been made of bone tissue although modern sharks lack bone, except for a tiny bit at the base of their teeth. Um, bone is known in some uh, fossil uh, sharks, uh, in some processes uh, on the dorsal surface, like this dorsal spine, uh, but then other regions of the shark skeleton in some fossils is calcified as well. And so Xenacanthus may have had calcified uh, tissue or, or uh, bone uh, in other regions of its skeleton in addition to uh, this uh, spine. Um, in addition, the pectoral uh, fins uh, had a segment uh, in uh, the middle of them, um, and the teeth uh, were V-shaped. And so uh, the Xenacanthus a genus of extinct uh, sharks was quite, uh, quite a long-lived uh, lineage of uh, sharks, but it is extinct today and left no descendants.